welcome to my YouTube channel. I am so excited. Y'all, tonight, I've got Bible study. I have got to make a dessert really quick, really fast, but really yummy. So, let me tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to make something you can make in literally 10 minutes. Pecan pie trifle. And it is delicious. And your people will think, your family, your people, whoever you serve it to, this head but anyway your people will love it it's delicious it's fast it is halfway homemade y'all give it a try let me know what you think okay in our bowl I've got two cups of milk, and I'm gonna add two more cups of milk. So that's a total of four cups of milk. Then I'm gonna add two packages. There's one. And here is two of vanilla instant pudding mix. And then we're just gonna mix this up really, really well until it starts thickening attachment that on there all right start off really slow or you will be wearing it all right just let that do its thing for a few minutes all right so once it gets a little thick you can go ahead and turn it up it's delicious all right and then we're gonna scrape down the sides of our bowl Get everything good in there. And y'all, don't be hating on my Christmas spatula. It is so good, even though it's May the 8th. It's okay. Got one brick of cream cheese that is softened. It is so important. And when you got one hand, just scrape it off with this. It's okay. You do what you gotta do. Get in there. All right, one. Y'all, I have made a mess. I have made a freaking mess, but it's okay. All right, do what you gotta do. One brick of cream cheese. Best tip ever, make sure it is room temperature. Very, very soft or you're gonna have a mess at this point. Beat it like it talks about your mama. Just get it so, so, so smooth and combined. All right, so now we're gonna add in one container of whipped topping, this is eight ounces. So we're just gonna take it. And the key to this too, make sure it is thawed. You don't want it to still be frozen. Gonna add in the whole tub. And then just mix it again. Make sure to scrape down your sides really well and then beat it one more time. This filling is delicious. Okay, so we have our filling made. Good, good stuff. Now let me show you what makes this so easy. Hey, y'all. This is such an easy dessert. You buy a pecan pie. You can use your favorite brand. Of course, you can make your own, but my gosh, it's so easy. You'll have this ready in no time if you just buy one. Now, my husband says he has the best pecan pie recipe ever. I'll have to get him on here and show you what he does. But, all right, so, First of all, we're gonna take this pecan pie out, throw this box away, nobody will know we didn't make our own. So now we're gonna get, get a pretty glass bowl, cause this, after all, is a trifle. You can get a fancy one. I'm making this for my Bible study group tonight. This will be fine for just us. So you're just gonna put some of the cream in the bottom, spread it out. Just like so. 
And y'all, by the time this is over, it's gonna be a mess. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna go in here and you're gonna crumble. The kids would love this. Crumble your pecan pie. Like I said, it's gonna be a mess. And put some of the pretty pecan around the edges because you know with the glass dish, it's gonna make it pretty. You will think you're playing with mud pies. Don't come at me for not wearing gloves because I have washed my hands for all you health inspectors out there. And I'll just go ahead and tell you, I licked the beater, but I didn't stick it back in the bowl. I got a little bit of sense. So you just break your pecan pie up, y'all. You're gonna think this woman is making a mess, and I am, but look how good. All right, my hands are filthy, but that's okay. I gotta wash these dishes. So then we're gonna take another layer of our pudding right on top. And y'all, this is perfect for like when you make a pecan pie and it doesn't turn out right. Maybe it's not set in the middle or whatever. You can make anything into a trifle that doesn't turn out. I've had cakes that when I have turned them out, a little bit stuck. Girl, get you some pudding. Crumble up your cake. Do some chips, uh, chocolate chips, the cream cheese chips. I love them. Uh, toffee bits in this would be great. You could drizzle some caramel sauce right here. And I know y'all can't see the top of my face, um, but I want you to see up close to this. And I had to put it on my tripod because my hands were gonna be so, so messy. But I mean, you let this sit and you, I'm sorry, let me go this way so you can see what I'm doing. But I'm just playing with my food. The kids would love to help you with this. And you just tear it up. Like I said, you could even do more nuts, some more pecans crumbled if you wanted to. You could add some toffee chips in here. I think that would be delicious. Um, make it your own. If you like caramel sauce, do that. Um, what I say, and I learned this, I don't know who, I think Paula Dean told me this. Told me like we're friends, you know what I'm saying. I saw it on her TV show. But anyway, I think she is the one that told me this, the first time you do a recipe, do it exactly like the recipe says. The second time, make it your own. So then we're gonna go on top of our last little bit of pie with this pudding mixture. And if you ever have had a derby pie, that would be delicious in here. Chocolate chip pie, but it's so good with a and look, we're gonna decorate this up with a little nuts on top. But look how pretty that is. And y'all, all we did was tear up a pecan pie. It's just a little different spin. And for the help. Mm -hmm. So good. That's it, y'all. Look how pretty. Well, my pudding got, okay, there is the picture perfect shot. Look how delicious is that. So, I think I will, I think I will, I've got some nuts in the pantry. Sprinkle a little bit of nuts on top. That's it. That is all. Y'all, this pecan pie trifle is so good. Now, if you want to get fancy, get some more Cool Whip. Y'all, I've got to push my glasses up, but look at my hands. Mm. Mm. Um, Cool Whip. Put it in a piping bag. Just pipe some Cool Whip, little rosettes. Whatever you want to do. But this is delicious. Y'all try it and let me know what you think. What do you think, Stephanie? Delicious. Yummy, 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 yummy. 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 Yay.